Hi all, and thanks for watching. This is the 41st video in my Kingdom Come Deliverance playthrough. And this is also the third part for the side quest masquerade. So hopefully we'll get that quest finished up in this video. And so we're just going to continue on and get started. Okay, so let's check the journal here. Some black feathers. Okay. Animal teeth, wolf fangs. Okay, let's see what we have on the horse here. Okay. Or hide. Okay, so I do have some dog skins. And I have a boar tusk. All right. Let me just check that again. Okay, so get some animal teeth, so I guess that fang work, and the dog skin I already had, so we have to find some black feathers. Black feather is as good as another. I'm sure chicken feathers will do just fine. Okay, let's look for some chicken feathers then. I guess what we'll look for some chicken coops or something. So let's see. Is that no, that's not a chicken coop. Oh, there's some chickens. Must have a coop somewhere. That looks like a chicken coop over there. Oh, you. Okay, let's go check out the chicken coop. It's either that or go and see if I can knock some nests out of the out of trees. Jesus! What, do I look beat up? Oh, it's ro robbing. He's thieving. Hey, people! Thieving! Oh, I didn't steal anything. God! Hey, you! Ah! Uh -huh. Surrender! You've committed a violation. Gee. You're under arrest. Ah! I yield! Dang. Someone saw you stealing. Well, but you I won't get this in a hurry, because it'll take a nice pile of coin to fix it. Really? All right, let's try the secret task. Just my luck. Look, I can't tell you anymore. The fate of the whole empire hangs in the balance between King Wenceslas and King Sigismund. High politics, you know? Not a peep to anyone. Well, I thought, that is, I had no idea. Well, if that's how it is, of course you may go. Oh, thank you. Excellent. Okay, so I'll make sure not to check the next coop in front of someone. I didn't even take anything. Okay. Well, at least I know what I'm looking for. I wonder if those birdhouses, the... 
these would have anything. Nope, nothing there. Okay. We'll search for some more chicken coops. Oh, there's another one. There doesn't seem to be anyone around. Nothing. there no what about here don't see any well you've got a chicken cube I'll just wait till she leaves here Okay, that's good. Oh, one black feather. Excellent. So we just have to find one more black feather. Well, this is a lot easier than trying to hunt down a wolf. I don't think I've actually ever seen a wolf in the game. What's he doing here? Father Godwin said he was from Prague. He wouldn't lie to us, would he? Not from the altar, anyway. Who knows? Maybe he'll settle down here and take Godwin's place. Everyone's fed up to the back teeth with all his boozing and bad behavior. The young fellow's not dressed like a priest, though, is he? I wonder what they're talking about. Something about Father Godwin. Well, let's see if we can find another chicken coop anyways. Apples, melons, prunes! Waking up your day! Nothing there. There's one there. Anyone around? I don't see anyone. Okay, let's see if there's a black feather here. Red feather. Nope. Don't need that. Oh, here's another coop. Just eggs. Here, there's an open coop. Here's a coop. Anyone watching? Oh, they're pretty far off. No, none there. These black feathers aren't that easy to find. Guess I just have to keep searching chicken coops until I find the other black feather.
here. That's just an open one. There you are. Onward, let's find a black feather. All right, we'll search the yeah. other side. Oh, there's a... Have I searched that cube yet? Let's have a look. This might be the one. Oh, there's a blacksmith over there. Oh, I don't see him around. A black feather, excellent. That's the one. So there is a blacksmith here in town. Although I don't see anyone. I wonder what those women were talking about, Father Godwin. They were mentioning a younger fellow. Okay, so we've got everything we need. So I guess we'll head back to the glade in a minute. Let's just have a quick word here with Father Godwin. Can't talk to him. Okay, let's head for the glade. That's right there. Okay, so looks like we got all the stuff to add to the cumin armor for our disguise. Horses on the road. It seems someone ambushed, has been ambushed. Uh, okay. Maybe I should have stopped. But I, I just got that stuff, and if I end up getting killed, then I don't know when the last save point was. Probably when I started this video. Andrew there and is that Matthew that's Fritz hey flop face Good look, then. he's got nothing to say I don't see Matthew though Okay, so we got to see Andrew here. A meal to go with the ale, please. Is that Matthew? Greetings, Henry. I want more money for that ring. And why is that? Because we're really good mates. <laughs> nice <laughs> try. God be with you. All right, so let's talk to Andrew here. Good health to you. Okay, I got everything. I got fucking everything. Wonderful. Come with me. Take care now. What's taking them so long? Oh, I really don't know. Ready? Good. Now put it on. Hmm. Well, that'll be an improvement. 
That's good. That's really fucking good. You don't think it's too much? It's perfect. If I met you at night, I'd shit myself. That's exactly what humans look like. Says the man who's never seen one. Well, I mean, that's exactly what people think humans look like. Yep, it's not too bad. It's not too bad at all. <laughs> We're only just getting started. Okay, so... Is that it? Okay, so that looks like that's it. I guess I go back to Andrew now. In order to get quests that we need, or what do I do? Hey, flop face! Good boy. Okay, nothing from him. Greetings, Henry. Nothing more from him. That's great. A lot of mischief. Okay. I had to talk with Andrew into working with us. In the end, he agreed to help with arranging the holdups. Okay, so then... Andrew came up with the idea, have cumin disguises for the holdups. So with quite a bit of work, I managed to get the cumin outfits. Okay, so let's go talk to Andrew. Yeah, it sounds yeah, like he's going to arrange holdups now. And... Armor. So there's that. Have you heard about anything interesting going on lately? Just some talk about lost sheep and indecent wenches. Probably nothing to interest you. Okay, so now he'll give us work. Maybe later. I was thinking of something more in the line of um, work opportunities. I don't really have anything specific right now, but I did hear about something, uh, something interesting from one of your neighbours. Who? I, I don't know his name, but it was about as old as you. He said his family owned the Scallets Tavern. Young Adam, then. And the interesting part? He decided he wanted to go back home, see the damage and so on. And someone looted it right in front of his nose. I know. I've met those scavengers before. It's not that interesting, just sad, really. It certainly isn't Christian. But the thing is, they were hiding money in that cellar of theirs. I wouldn't count on it. The looters probably spent all of it by now if he crawled into the right tavern. And anyway, I'm sure they didn't exactly have the royal treasure hidden there. This Adam said it was enough to fix a whole cottage. Or to go exploring the world. All right, but it still seems shady. And you haven't really given me much to go on. Maybe, but I don't have anything better. Why don't you find him and ask him and see where it leads you? And did he say where he was going? He said he's going to Ratai, that he has some arrangements there. It won't be easy to find him. Ratai's a little overcrowded nowadays. Then you'll have to ask someone, won't you? Bloody hell. You want me to hold your hand while you do it? I'll be on my way then. Go. Go. And ask him when you see him. Maybe you'll think of something. How's trade? Any trouble around these parts? Nothing we can't handle. All right then. God be with you. So I guess we're done masquerade, so at one point we'll probably need that disguise. And he's given us another quest. Besmirched. Find the Rob man in Rattay.
and help Andrew find out more. Okay. Adam from Scallets. So I guess we're gonna have to head to Rete. Not really sure where, when I'm gonna use that disguise. But I'm sure we'll find out. Okay, so... So he could be anywhere here. Hasn't got a job for me heard about some opportunities. Okay, so let's head to Rete. So maybe if I do stuff for Andrew, then he'll arrange some of those highway holdups that I needed the disguise for. I'm not really sure. But I'll hold on to the disguise for now anyways and see what happens. I guess we're looking for Adam. Alright. I feel quite so, hungry. Okay, let's grab some food here. Okay, I didn't expect that, but let's see. You'll lose your shirt tonight. Tijin. I hope I can be of help to you, Knight. See you later. Let's see, we'll ask some of the Scallets people here. I'm at your service, Sir Knight. Take care. Oh, he's the one that wanted me to do that pickpocketing. Houndsman. Guard. Okay, let's just look for a bagger. Oh, is that more food? What am I to do with the Skull, it flies in ruins! That's great. A bit of extra coin never hurt. God's blessings. Take care. Okay, she doesn't know anything. Alex. Greetings. I'm looking for Adam. Do you know where he might be? The young innkeeper. Either with the horses or at the tavern. He seems to like one just as much as the other. See you later. Okay, let's have a look at the map here. Alright, so he's down at the end there. Let's just call our horse. There you are, Pebbles. Pebbles. She could kind of rename the horse, but I guess you gotta take what you get. Yeah. Ah, oh, Lord Capon's horse. Here. 
see him. In your own back. Where are you? Oh, Adam. Excellent. God be with you. What can I do for you? You went to Scallets on your own, didn't you? That took guts. Not... not really. It took me a while before I could work up the courage. That was sensible of you. I went back straight away, and I almost got killed. I know. I heard. That's part of the reason I was so nervous. And how did it go? Did you do everything you wanted? There wasn't anyone... anything to do. Someone already did it before me. I wasn't even able to catch that thieving bastard. What thief? Some shady-looking character. Whole face smeared with soot. He shot out of the basement as soon as I went by and ran away with his loot. I got such a scare. I didn't think about running after him. And he stole absolutely everything. Even our new kettle. What did he look like? I didn't get a good look at him. He was covered in soot. And his sack of loot was so full, he had the kettle tied to it on the outside. It was gleaming. A sooty man, a big sack, and a new kettle. Of course, he could clean himself up and throw away the sack. Maybe it was a devil. Or a charcoal burner. You know, it really could have been a charcoal burner. That sack definitely looked like a charcoal burner's sack. And there are a lot of those around Rovna, so he wouldn't have far to go. What was it he took from your place? I don't know. My father told me never to talk about it. What harm is there in telling me now? I can't steal it. Someone got there before me. That's true. My father hid some money and valuables there. There was... there was a jeweled cross. He wanted to give Bianca as a dowry. That was your girlfriend. What did the cross look like? Why do you ask? Well, if I saw it somewhere... I'd... What? You want to look for it? Well, like I said, if I see it or hear something about it, we'll see. That would be so kind. I have nothing left. If I had that cross, at least I'd have something to remember them all by. The cross itself was silver, and it had a small red ruby in the middle, like a heart. And it was hanging on a red string. And did you tell the catchpoles about it? I did. Alex asked me what happened and then sent me straight to them. And what happened? They said they were sorry, but they don't have anyone who could search all the houses looking for a kettle. So they told me if I don't know who it was, then there's nothing they can do. Good luck, then. Okay. So what now? Will help Andrew find out more, find Adam's valuables, and give them back to him instead of Andrew. Inform innkeeper Andrew. Let's mount up. And take a little trip. So I guess we'll go back and talk to Andrew here at the Glade. Wonder if it's going to be too late by the time I get there. Almost 11 o'clock. Oh, he's still out. Excellent. Good health to you. One beer for me. 
I found Adam and asked him about his stolen stuff. And did you find out anything useful? You could say that. It was a man covered in soot who stole a new kettle and a silver cross. No one tried to sell me a kettle, but... Uh, that cross had a red stone and string, right? How did you know? Don't tell me you're a fortune teller. Of course not. Someone offered to sell it to me, but the whole thing seemed shady, so I told him I didn't want it. And do you have any idea who it was? I don't know his name. Just said he's a charcoal burner. He's from Rovna and only shows up here occasionally. So a complete stranger just happens to wander in here and offers to sell you a stolen cross? Come on, you definitely know who it was. I have got a reputation for being reliable and being able to arrange certain things. Yes, that's what Fritz said. Andrew's the man to go to if you need anything tricky arranging. So surely you know what the charcoal burner's name is, right? Well, I don't know everything. Just that the charcoal burner is called Tonchek, and he's from Rovna. But as for where exactly, I can't help you. I never went there, and I didn't ask. So what did he say? Nothing. He wanted something to eat and drink, and then left. And that's it? Yes. If he cursed me, then he did it under his breath. All right, I'll look into it. So we found out a bit more information. So Ravna, right there. Just a better mount up. And we'll do a bit more traveling. Should get there fairly early. But at least now we have the fellow's name who we're looking for. I think I'll avoid them. All right, I'll avoid that. Excellent success on both. What time is it? It's fairly early. Actually, I should be able to rest here. But let's see. Okay, so right there is where I want to go. Just follow the river up, where this road goes through the bushes. So probably following the river up will be the easiest way. Is there a bed in there? Excellent. Oh, and it will save right here too. Just rest for a few hours. Guess I'll rest till about eight o'clock. So if anything happens, now I'm saved right here. There seems to be someone over there. I wonder if that's the priest.
So we've got a few townspeople back. Yeah, Father Simon. So this road goes through the bush and then splits off towards the water. And I've got to go somewhere up around there. So besmirched. This looks like the camp, and the game just saved. Oh, that was good. I see someone down there. Let's have a look around. Charcoal kiln. Wonder if he has it. Has that kettle? This one is old and scuffed. Right, so it's not that one. But I guess that's what we're looking for. Another one around? See any other kettles? Is there any other kettles around? Hey, let's talk to this fellow here. Jesus Christ be praised. Have you been to Scallets lately? What would I be doing there? Everything's burnt down. Someone saw a charcoal burner rooting around there. And how does anyone know it was a charcoal burner? I'd like to know. Well, they said he had a charcoal sack and... Sacks aren't hard to come by. Especially around skeletons. Anyone could have one. Including the guilty man. Well, maybe it wasn't me and you're looking for someone else. All right then, I believe you. So you probably don't know who it really was, do you? No, I don't. There are plenty of charcoal burners round here, but who's to say it's one of them you're looking for? Fine. Thanks, then. May the Lord watch over you. There's another fellow up there. So I don't think it was him. He had an old kettle.
about you? Have a new kettle? Just eat from pot. Oh, what's this? A completely new kettle. Could it be the one stolen from Scallets? Uh, okay. I'm at your service, Sir Knight. Oh, you've got a nice new kettle. Yeah. It cost me a groschen or two. Like hell it did. That cost you nothing but a bit of sneaking around. What are you trying to say? Hmm. I don't want to fight with them. Stole that kettle from Scallets. I don't know if he actually stole it. Fine. I believe you. Farewell. You're the charcoal burner, Tonchek. That I am. What do you want? I heard you had a nice cross. I did. But what's that to you? Just making sure I want to buy it. I want to buy it from you. You're too late. I don't have it anymore. Uh, that's a shame. And who did you sell it to? You're a nosy one, aren't you? But what the hell? He ratted me out anyway. I sold it to Andrew. Good luck to you. Sold it to Andrew? Hmm. So this is a fellow. Guess we'll see what this says. Just have a look here. Oh, nothing there. I can't talk to this fellow anymore. Don't want to try and pickpocket him. I haven't really practiced that. All right, let's call Pebbles and head back and talk to Andrew. So we'll head back to the glade here. So he should have the cross. We'll find out anyways when we get there. Otherwise we'll be traveling, I guess, back to the charcoal burner maybe. We'll find out in a minute here. Okay, Andrew, what do you got to say? Good health to you. 
I just wanted to ask about the cross. What about it? It wasn't with the rest of the loot, and he said that he sold it to you. Can you believe him? I'd like to buy it from you. You would? Well, if the price is right, how much are you offering? And 45. All right, that should cover my costs and efforts. So it looks like he did have it. How's trade? Any trouble around these parts? Nothing we can't handle. his other valuables. Okay, so we'll head down to again and we'll give Adam the cross now it doesn't include his kettle or coin that he lost but at least it's something it did actually cost me some coin I've gone too far. I'll bring it right away. I'll bring it right away. There's the executioner. Let's find Adam here. That's him back there. No, oh, didn't mean to call my horse. I'll be with you. What can I do for you? You won't believe it, but I found Bianca's cross. Really? How did you find it? Well, it's a long story. And? It's yours. Take it. Thank you, Henry. This is the only memory I have of them. How much do I owe you? can spare a little something, then that's all I need. Of course, Henry. I definitely won't skimp on you. God be with you. 450. Wow. Andrew, find out more about the looting. 
find Adam's valuables and give them back. Did I miss something here? Okay, I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do. But it doesn't seem that the quest is over. Not seen any of the markers. So what do I do here? Let's see. So I guess I need to go talk to Andrew and let's Sorry. talk to Adam again. So what am I to do? See you later. Okay, let's go talk to Andrew. Just not really sure what I'm supposed to do at this point. There's no actual markers anymore. And he did charge me for the cross. Maybe I was supposed to get the kettle and stuff back too. Well, at least I know where the fellow is and where the kettle is. Although I didn't really find anything in his chest. Greetings. How's trade? Any trouble around these parts? Nothing we can't handle. So there's really nothing there. And I got the cross. Let's just head back over to Bravna and we'll try talking to that fellow. Scout. All right, what's this person? Doing? He's here. Show what you're made of. Oh, it was an ambush. Yeah. Oh, they've been chasing me for a while. There we go. Okay, we'll just continue.
continue heading to Ravna. And I'll just rest and save here. Now I'm not really sure what I have to do at this point for this quest. So I'm actually going to just end the video here and maybe take a look online. I don't really like to really look up information, but I'm kind of really left with out too much to go on here as there's really nothing else here. And I did turn in that cross, so I kind of thought someone was snooping around, looting, someone on to look into it, and of course stealing. Thief is no great thin, sin. Oh. Okay, let's just rest and we'll go over and I'll see he's going to be sleeping so let me just go over there and I'll check out what he's got there because I know the kettle's there so maybe I can take the kettle and see what else we can do there Yeah! Okay, so he was a fellow up here. So I'm just going to check out right over here. Can't take the kettle. Missed this one last time. Just a torch. Anything else around? Wonder if I have to pickpocket him. Uh really wasn't very good at pickpocket. What? What the fuck are you doing? Keep your sticky fingers to yourself. Uh, now he's running away. I bet you that's what I have to do is pick his pocket.
Oh well. Boots. All right. Well, I guess there's not really much I can do here at the moment. So I guess I'll wait and find Adam's valuables, give them back to him instead of Andrew. All right, I'm gonna just go online and look up what I have to do here. I'm really not too sure at this point. I'm thinking I probably have to pickpocket him, but I'll have to probably load it from the last location just before I got here in order to test that theory out. So I'm just going to end the video off here. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. And again, that quest is called the Smirch that we were working on. And we did finish up Masquerade. So it looks like Andrew's actually giving us some side quests now. Although I guess we have to finish this one up before Andrew will give us any more. So hopefully we can get some more quests from Andrew once I figure out how I'm supposed to actually finish this one up. Now if there is any comments or questions, just leave them in the comment section below. Otherwise, thanks a lot for watching. Take care, and I'll see you in the next video.